Alrighty guys, time for some more Oblivion. That's right, we just let Phytharn. Okay. So we were taking the pass to the southwest, or just west. stuff is for the quest. I don't really need anything to be made with the alchemy. Black tar. Don't worry, guys. I got you. Mad gods. Walk with our Lord. Lost time camp. I feel like this was around when my game crashed last time. Alright. Almost to the end of the Mad Gods boot. the actual path running through all this water. Just found Corpse Rot Passage. I do wish that they had added a uh, like different, more, more different music. And like, I mean, I love the Oblivion music, but it would have been cool to have, um, like more Shivering Isle specific music. Need your heart. Thank you. can't uh, die until we actually killed off the, the beacon here. Hearts of Order. Just close all of the gates. I really don't need that many arrows. I'm going to drop all my non magical arrows and see where that gets me. Yeah, we go. That 
the gummy underneath, and I still got plenty of arrows. I need to get rid of Dong Fang when I get a chance. It's 47, uh, 47 pounds. I really don't need. This is just a cell. Whatever. I can move again. It's fine. Oh, the arrows. All right, back to the the path here. Hello. Some sort of landmark up here. What's it gonna be? Pinnacle Rock. No mortal may enter the halls of Pinnacle Rock. But what if we wanna? All right. Well, I found it now. That's cool. Right, I'm gonna go back through the door of Cyrodiil, go back to my house, drop off my stuff, and then I uh, come back. You can't see me. Stay away from me. You've already spent too much time over there. All right, Caius. Fast travel to my house real quick. Okay. Drop off some stuff. Go back. Sell it. I sell the stuff I want to sell. I honestly don't know why I keep all this stuff. Like, I keep all these, like, special weapons, and I just never use them. I mean, not like they can make me a ton of money, but still. Well, I'm gonna take it all. I can't take it all, but... That's a good ring. I forgot about that I had that ring. Let's see. Nurn roots, poison apples. Can't sell that for anything. Can't sell that for anything. Can't sell those. That's good. Okay, I'm gonna go sell the rest. To away. eating dinner. Come on, come on over. So I'm going to change my ring for my ring of wizardry. May I lose some weight capacity? Um, oh, you know what? I need to go right here so I can sell to him, otherwise I'm gonna... It's all over, lawbreaker. Your spree is at an end. What? Can you see me? Am I not fully invisible right now? Chameleon 90. 
What am I not wearing that I normally wear? Got boots, which give me 30. Tagged you in that uh, data video. I'm at their shop, they're watching something confusing. What are they watching? But it's amusing, like a movie or like a random clip or something or what? Stay away! Oh my god! I haven't seen it yet. Oh, okay. What are they watching? They're watching a movie. What movie are they watching? Oh my god, dude! I'm not ready to just kill this guard. Raise my bounty, any? It's called Inside the Barn. Oh, yeah, that's the one he like filmed by himself and everything, the entire thing. Special thing. You need something. Yeah. I Let's do something. business. Oh, you need to make a bet. How's my day? It's all right, man. You know, just work and uh, you know, uh, after work, worked on some homework for for a while. Made dinner. Made some. Uh, Italian sausage with broccoli and bell peppers. It was gonna have carrots and cucumber also, but I waited too long apparently, and they went bad. So that's a fit. Um, you drive up. But yeah, how about you? What you been up to today? You got a great. That's. It's been such a You got a great day. deal there. Oh, that's a bummer. Just day seeming to never end, or just shit dragging you down. That's a good deal. Well, you drive a hard bargain. Both. Yeah, fair enough. Well, hopefully that you're almost at the end of your day here. You just relaxing with them, or do you have anything else you got to do today? I have more homework that's to do, but I got everything that's due tomorrow done, and I'll just uh, that's a not fair much. deal. That's good. I'll do the rest of my homework hopefully you tomorrow. The only thing I have going on tomorrow after work a is uh, that's a good deal. Ted and his coworkers uh, are doing a like a uh, like a You've team a building thing at his work, playing Halo. And they invited me, so you drive I'm gonna be doing that. But besides that, I really don't have any plans for tomorrow, so it's just gonna be homework. You got a great deal there. Damn, I got so much money now. You're gonna stomp? I don't know, man. We'll see. We got some Xbox players, some PC players. I don't know how many of them actually have any experience with that. 
we shall you find drive a out. hard bargain walk always all right got 100 more and I just need to sell some shadow potions shadow. that I've got a shit ton of no no don't go to sleep don't go to sleep uh, I've got to download it though I've got to find some whatever game I want to delete because I just got uh keep looking for that just got down re downloaded Vermintide again the other day. And um that takes up a bunch of room. And then Arc takes up like fucking three hundred and fifty gigabytes. So I need to uh figure out what I'm gonna delete to um make room for it because I'm like sixty gigs short for Halo. Any luck on yeah. Only quality goods for sale. That's just. Why is my disposition? Tell so you. Low? Make it quick. That's great. How's it go again? Well, huh? so you say. You're too kind. What a thoughtful gift. It's not what I meant to do. Oh. Talk tough. So you say. Shit. So you like these two. I doubt it. What a f That's really funny. Down, That's up, great. Thank you. Up, so you say. Huh? That's really... That never happened. That's cute. That works for me. What can I interest you in? Okay. You're trying to drive me... So all of this stuff. Yeah, we played some more uh, Don't Starve together last night with one of my friends. That's a good. It was a lot of fun. That game's always fun. Uh, we didn't get terribly far. We only, uh, her son woke up, so we had to stop, but we've got That's a good quite a bit of food. We're fairly secure. We've got a That's lot of the, the technological stuff, and, uh, we're not, we're not yet to our first winter. I think we're, like, halfway to winter, That's a but we're going to play more again here soon. Her and I are the ones out of our group that have played the most, um, so... We, uh, we're both stoked to be playing more of it. She's playing, uh, you got Woodworm, Wood, Woodworm, which is like a plant character. So, like, he loses sanity if he, like, picks any, uh, fruits or veggies or anything like that. But, uh, he gets, he's allowed to, uh, so I'm, I'm selling one by one because she only has 50 gold total to give. So if I sell, like, this is already worth more than 50, I'm already having to lose money. But if I sell, like, both of them at the same time, I'm still only getting $50 at a time. So if I sell it that way, I end up losing a ton of money. Good drive up. Um, but yeah, so the cool thing with her character, though, was that he can plant got... seeds without needing a garden or anything. So we can get a ton of fruit that way and stuff like that. And since I'm, uh, I'm playing my spider dude, you got a great I, uh... Today. Man, I still gotta get rid of 85 of those. Um... Actually, let's just sell these. No deal. Oh shit! They're one each. Five. Um. Transaction limit. Yeah. You got. Uh, what have you been playing though, dude? I haven't seen you on much lately. I think I saw you on something called Green Hell yesterday. Something like that. Mercantile increased. You got But I have no idea what that is. That's a good That's a fair You 
drive a hard bargain. All right, that should be fine. How am I doing? Wait, nice. One hundred fifty-one. Invite Teddy to play Siege. Right on. You guys in your siege. His name is Teddy. Uh, his name's Ted. His username on everything is just Teddy Machete. Sickly Bernice, her supposed cure. Yeah, Vermintide was cool though, dude. We played the, uh... First time I've played the, like, uh... Roguelike, uh, mode they added recently. It's pretty fun. Uh, gotta find the thing that opens them. Yeah, that's what it was. Somebody's bad. Ooh, another potion. The hatchery. Closely followed this little statue. Recover the samples. Scribe. Should return to New Shath for some time. Alright, easy enough. Everything's much easier when you're invisible all the time. Yeah. Fucking guess. like that, we're in and out. Alright, sickly Bernice. Gave those maniacs something to think about. Lighting the torch for us. Well done. Yeah, you're welcome. The Ballywog are no. Let me see. Please accept this as a gesture of thanks. <laughs> All right. 
Now she gave me a little circlet. Oh, it's a ring. I was thinking it was like an actual hat. Now my skills are so good. Alright, now let's see what quests we got. Uh, the Museum of Oddities, we can go turn this in. Second here. Okay, I'm gonna turn in the like tooth maid key or whatever I found. Hound tooth key to the museum. After I stole some of the stuff, it's only right I give some back. Welcome to the. Have you found a new one? What a perfect little oddity! Just strange enough that it makes you go, hmm, but not so strange as to become a miracle or an omen. Thank you. That's all I've got for the oddities right now. Let's see. I don't have five flawless pearls yet. Alright, we're just going to continue the main quest here then. Bye. Bye. So I've got to either take over as the Duke of Mania or the Duchess of Dementia. So let's go uh, talk to the peeps. Yeah, bloodstains. You chose well. The great torch shines with the luster of dementia and the glory of Sheogora. Yeah. Interesting. Not many wish to hear about such things, but I would be glad to oblige. Becoming the Duke of Dementia requires passage through the ritual of accession. Specific guidelines set forth by Ard and Sue himself. Seldom is the subject ever br Wait a moment. Did you want to hear the history Anything of the ritual? Deal? Not really, dude. Um, you know, just working in school. That's about it. My garden is crushing it right now. It's pretty cool. Uh, I finally got my sunflowers have, getting the actual flower part of them now. They finally started doing that. They're like two feet taller than I am. At least the couple that are fully grown. So that's pretty cool. The, all the flowers I picked are once bees-like, so there's a shit ton of bees in my garden now, which is cool. Two feet taller than me. Yep. Not particularly tall, but it's like six feet tall. <laughs> I knew where you are going with that. Uh, I'm 5'6", sir. Um, but yeah, so I got those. Uh, got a water fountain, but the bees don't really like it. I think it's because there's moving water. Because bees don't like to get water that they can't like stand in. I was going to put some pebbles in there, but I think the moving water is still throwing them off. So, um, I think I might just get like more of a bird feeder type thing rather than an actual fountain. Um, but other than that, it's uh, really about it. I'm not particularly exciting. Uh, next weekend is, or next Friday is my anniversary. Me and my wife will have been married for five years on Friday. Um, my friends from Washington came over, came down last Sunday, so we got to have brunch with them. Are you doing anything special? Um, we haven't really figured it out yet. My wife keeps saying she wants to do something, but when I ask her what she wants to do, she says she doesn't know. So I might need just need to plan something myself. Do you have to beat up the bully kid's parents? <laughs> yeah, I talked to the teacher and everything, and the teacher is making it seem like Bianca... Like, not that she's lying, but like that Bianca misconstrued the situation. I mean, which is possible. Kids aren't the most reliable sources, but still, if I find someone's beating my, like, bullying my kid, I'm gonna go have a word with their parents. Um, but, I don't know, she still seems stoked to go to school, but she's always so quiet and shy when she goes to school. Like, she's really excited, and once she gets there, though, she, like, walks with her head down and, like, takes small steps and everything like that. And apparently she's, like, super quiet all day. But then, like, as soon as we get there, she's, like, 
super excited and stuff like that but when we talk to her she like loves preschool and she talks about how much she loves it and she gets excited to go back and stuff so i'm not really sure i think part of it's just the age difference because she went to preschool a little early um so some of the kids are, young, are uh, older than her so i think that she's a little thrown off by that but no uh, she's only been back for like a, a month and a half not even something like that you went to school early too high five um so yeah so i think she'll get more comfortable with it as time goes on and stuff like that but uh yeah we'll see i graduated when i was 17 because my birthday's in june so i graduated like three days or i turned 17 like three days before i graduated as it happened so many years ago my lord Arden Sewell suspected a traitor in his midst. He went to school early Not too. wishing to find himself on the wrong end of a blade, he gathered his flock oh. here in the Sacellum. What about you, dude? What have you been up to? By poisoning the sacramental wine, Arden Sewell was able to You're suppress still babysitting any and all that such on Sundays? in one fell swoop. And how's D&D &D going? You still got your campaign going on? Yes. He then removed their hearts from their bodies and used his ancient scrying technique, He's known a monster. as visceromancy, to read their lifeblood. When Arden Sewell well, hopefully a happy little the monster. traitor's true nature in their hearts, he became trip. distraught uh... and took his own life in the same way. From that day on, the ritual of accession for the throne of the didn't pan out. That's right. Set. He didn't show up. Guess you'll die. Very well. Spoken like a true son of the Demented. To become the ruler of Dementia, the current leader's heart must be cut out and brought to the altar of Arden Sul in the Sacellum. Once this is done, I can pronounce the heart bearer a duke or duchess. Then, all that is required is the blessing of our what lord. What character are you playing? Shilgur. I might have asked you this before, but I don't remember, like, race and class and stuff. You haven't spoken to both priests. You'll end up making a stupid nice. decision, and you. We uh, did a post-apocalyptic game again. like two well, campaigns ago, and uh, <laughs> one of the homebrew classes that we had was a plague doctor. I'm disappointed in your choice. Why you would choose to honor the fetid madness of Dementia is beyond my understanding. Yes, our. He was the sovereign of thought, and a regnant word yeah, yeah, yeah. had an important part of our history, my friend. I would be glad to tell the tale. It's pretty empowered now that I'm playing it. Well, it's a bummer. Arden Sewell was perhaps the greatest duke to walk our land. Many years ago, he decided to hold a night of absolute indulgence, resplendent with dance, wine, and sex to celebrate his fondness for his brethren. The green moat flowed like water in a stream as the revelers voraciously succumbed to its rapturous waves. Ah, but it was. As the bacchanal reached a crescendo, the people began to clutch their chests as their very hearts exploded. Bam, bam, bam. The green moat had taken its toll. The ground stained a deep crimson as the sanguine liquid flowed from their life. I like all bodies. the beast races they added when they uh, came out night, with. When the ruler was it Mordecai's Tome of Foes that had all those? He partakes of the green moat and allows his lifeblood to flow upon the altar. Certainly. When the ruler of Mania has decided it is time, he will choose a successor from his court. The successor is invited to a huge celebration, a night of hedonistic revelry, wine, song, and of course, green moat. During this, the exiting regent imbibes three doses of the potent drug. This causes his heart to burst and his lifeblood flows from his body. The successor then gathers the drug-tainted blood 
and brings it to the altar of Arden Su in the Sasselum. Once this is done, I will proclaim the successor a duke or duchess. Then, Cher Gorath gives his blessing, and the cycle is completed. Party until the other guy dies. Hello. You're back! How nice for you! Does that mean you've made a decision? Or are you lost? Suicidal? Just let me know. A friendly word of warning before you choose. Once you've decided which duke to replace, there's no turning back. One choice. No more. No less. Try not to do something stupid. So which is it? What will it be? Mania? Dementia? The suspense is killing me! Or you, if I have to keep waiting. Alright, I think I'm gonna go with Dementia, since I've been helping them out anyways. I do feel bad killing Syl. I'd rather kill Thaden, but I don't really care about Mania, so being in charge of them is meh. A dangerous choice. I like it! <laughs> She's gotten to be a bit much anyway. Thinks everyone is out together. Which they are in this case. So be it. It'll be, you should. But, if we can get you into sh He'll be here soon. And I'll be go- Syl is as crafty as she is beautiful. I'd watch my back if I were you. Oh, this is so much fun! We will speak when your task is complete. Alright. I think they've lived in the wild for too long. Goodbye. I'm gonna go to New Sheaf. Now I need to learn about her. Hey, hey, bud. Hey, bud. What is it you require? I suppose I should be grateful working in the palace with her. But I can't stand having to constantly look over my shoulder. I don't know if she has it in for me or not. I think she is in constant fear of being replaced. No, I cannot even think such thoughts. How do I know? I can trust you won't become just as tyrannical as she has. Sometime. Yes? Right, you like win the these. don't talk such rot. That's pretty f that works for me. No. Oops. I'm listening. Don't waste your flattery on me. Yeah. You oh, that's great. That's really too much. <laughs> I can't argue with that. What nonsense. I doubt it. No. I'm gonna have I'm to listening. bribe you, dude. I appreciate the gesture. No. I'm listening. I'll take that. Yes. There we go. I see you may have what it takes to replace her. Very well. What is it you need from me? Working about now. All good, man. Mm. That may be difficult. Take this key. It should unlock any door in her wing of the palace. All right. Let's talk to Anya. Ah. She is staying well out of sight. I maintain a close watch on her. Sickly Benicia. This better be good. My life is drab and wretched by can well, You've got a... That's just not funny. Gracious, you think that's funny? Don't talk such rot. That, that's, um, that's just stupid. That works for me. Huh, you're mad. Unless, well, if you think you have a chance, 
How do I know this isn't some sort of trick? Go ahead. How nice. Perhaps I've misjudged you. All right. What can I... Well, the best I can offer is help with the guards. I can distract at least two of them and get them to leave her wing of the palace. That should help you to get in there a bit easier. Okay. Now time to murder her. place you got here, Sil. Who sleeps like that? Don't ha. be fooled. The ritual isn't over. The body on the bed isn't Sil, but merely an impersonator. The real Sil she wasn't uses she was dead. many such decoys to throw would-be killers off her trail. Sil has made her escape through the hidden tunnel in the... Be wary. Can't even take her dress. Alright, let's see. Is there anything I want to steal while I'm in here? The dagger of friendship. Oh, that's hilarious. You heal people by stabbing them. Found a dagger of friendship which heals anyone that strikes. That's awesome. Got anything else? Good. Madness sword. Patrick arrows. Ooh. Discover the secret door. Hey! What's going on, Dalish? I did not even see you in there. Were you laughing about the dagger of friendship? Because that's pretty awesome. Bunch of skeleton bones. Yep, makes sense. Damn, damn. What are you up to? That was your stream earlier. You playing more Resident Evil? Is that what you're playing? Uh, I would have popped in, but I've been trying to get homework done. A little behind this week. I'm just eating right on. Damn. I'm all the way back in the beginning. Potions of healing. Yeah. They're going to talk to me even though I'm invisible. What's up, guys? I don't want to kill these guards because they're going to be my guards, so. Don't mind me. Alright. I'm 
bunch of boxes. Some torches, more torches. Oh, paintbrush. I'm not actually using the paintbrushes to just go around to do anything, but I keep collecting them. Alright. Like the uh, flickering light. Don't mind me, guys. Alright, what we got in here? Some gold. Almost to like 85,000 gold. Is there... I feel like there was a switch somewhere, I can't remember. All of them are looking down except for this one. remember how to open the door. I'd rather not kill these people if I don't have to. Making it far more complex than it actually is. Uh, I'm coming for you, so. Nice, got some more potions. And I am tired. I might not stream my whole uh, BRB, all good. I'm gonna not stream my whole amount tonight. I am tired. Hello. Oh, cards. Royal guards. What's up, Sil? Ah, I am fight to the death. I'll take the heart. You're not gonna do anything because you can't see me. Should make it quicker. Like a different way to get in. I don't know. Might as well explore while we're here. Huh. You did not take much damage from that. Okay. Lots of torches. Fancy, fancy. Place is falling apart. Alright, let's break in here. Might as well just take it all. We need a torch. Alright, there's a door. There's another path here. in these jail cells here. Uh, a whole lot of 
nothing in this one. Nothing besides the replete shambles in this one. Excuse me, sir. Treasure chest. Got a couple of things. Alright, now let's go back this way here. It's part of finding such low amounts of gold. Like, I'm pretty high level. Uh, made it. I didn't think I was going to. Pop out on the outside of wherever this leads. Nope. Hello, Dark Zeusers. Where am I? Hm. Alright. Now let's go put in the heart and become the Duke of Dementia. Fire. Once again has the ritual of accession come full circle. The heart of Sil has been consumed by Arden Sul's will, and the demented welcome you with open arms. I now declare you to be Duke of Dementia of the Shivering Isles. May your wrath and anger be your guide. Pleasure and pain. You have done it! The ritual is complete, and you've survived! Oh, who'd have thought? Now, on to other... Wait, I must speak. Halt, cease, desist. Bam, bam, bam. Maiden, how dare you interrupt me? Only I interrupt me. Like, just then. I'm speaking with someone. We'll talk later. Or not. When is later exactly? Not now, I'm sure of that. Guards! I think Thaden forgot how to use the door. Kindly show him out before I forget myself. Anybody? Sil? My. Sil is dead? This can't be right. Is this right? What have you done? Have you done this? Hold your tongue, little duke, or I'll tear it from your mouth. But this stranger? Someone new? From somewhere else? Not no. here. I'm sure of that. I don't understand. He is not no, happy. I can't. Calm yourself, Thaden. You're making my teeth itch. You still hold your office. I suggest you see to your duties. Ridiculous. You can't do this, although you're omnipotent or just tall. It's one of the two, I'm sure. And a fool. Fool? Visionary! Changes in the air, Thetan. Breathe it We've deep. We've made ourselves an enemy. Bathe in its scent. Bottle it up. Save some for later. Order approaches. It's taken the fringe already. With order clothes and order hats. And you speak of change? Change will preserve us. It is the lifeblood of the Isles. It will move mountains. It will mount movements. No, no, certainly not. This isn't good. I'm sure it's bad. I can't do this anymore. No more. No more. Then go, Thetan. Have your green moat. Take a bath. But leave before I decorate my throne with your insides. Yes, that's it. I'll go. Away, far away. Working for them is like working for us, but without all the dying. Traitor! No! Let him go. Enough! I go to Jigalag. I give myself to him as a priest of order. This isn't done, that god. I think it's just started. 
Goodbye, Thaden, with your dumb robes. Alright. Wondering why I let him go, aren't ya? I can see it in your face. Mostly in the eyes. I may take those from you when this is done. This has never happened before. The ruler of Mania, turning traitor. Unprecedented. But different is good. A new act in this play. Maybe we're onto something here. We'll see how it plays out. It can't be worse than what's happened before. If you say so. I do. I did. And I won't say it again. But that's enough about that. You're the ruler of dementia. Just look at you. You're positively beaming. You now have the power to summon dark seducers. They've always served the Duke of Dementia. I think they have a thing for pain. And here is the Ring of Lordship. A symbol of your new station. Rings, thank you. Symbols are important. They carry weight in this realm and others. You would be well served to remember that. He was right about that. I can feel it in my bones. In my bones. Little ones. The Grey March has swept the fringe. Order gathers its forces there as we speak. And I hate when people gather forces in my fringe. You'll need to put an end to that. Stop them. My army should already be there. But I want you to see what you can do to help. If they continue to marshal their forces there, we won't be able to contain them. Make sure they can't. It swept the fringe. That's not good. See if you can't hold them off there. Because if you can't, everyone is going to die. No pressure. No pressure. They'll get more and more active as the Grey Mark. Uh, ah. Yeah, yeah. All right. Congratulations. Poof. Just like that, disappeared. Ring of Lordship gives me endurance, chameleon. How much is this chameleon? Thirty-five percent in speed. This is thirty-two percent and fortifies endurance. Yeah, I don't really need endurance, but having the ring probably wouldn't be too bad a thing. But then I'll be slower also. Whatever. I just won't wear the ring. I'm gonna go light myself on fire. <laughs> Doesn't actually light me on fire, hi. but hi. <laughs> That's one thing you can do in this game is if you can get to a door as you're falling, as long as you can open it before you hit the ground, you won't take any fall damage. Alright, here we go. Into the fringe. Now it's all ordered. Surprised they didn't destroy a statue. Everything's got the obelisks now. Fall back, Nazkin. Retreat. Fall back to the town center. Na Your Grace, the situation is grim. Passwall is under attack. We are outmatched and outnumbered. Last night, as dusk fell, the spire at the center of town became active. Soon okay. after, the area around it began to crystallize and change. It wasn't long after that, the knights came. Knights, tell me about them. The knights are relentless. They do not tire. They do not fear. And they do not stop coming. They appear out of nowhere at the base of the spire. We kill five of them. Five more come. We've lost too many of the Maskin already. I fear that we will not be able to hold the town for much longer. The Spire? You've seen the Spire in Passwall. It is believed to be a monument from times past, but its true purpose appears to be more sinister. 
It appears to be a source of power for these invaders. A, a portal or some sort of gate. I don't know. Gotta destroy it. If we cannot disable or destroy it somehow, Just like I do not Oblivion think games. that we can stop this invasion. I do have an idea how we might be able to stop them, but I've been losing Mazkin with each attack, and I'm down to nothing but men. Uh, we are pinned man. down here. If we lose, the gates of madness will fall. If the gates fall, the enemy will flood into the Isles. We will be helpless to stop them. We cannot talk now. Even though I have served with these Mazkin for decades as the Duke of Dementia, it is your right to command the troops. Command them if you will, or leave it to me. Either way, make haste. Our time is short. I trust your judgment. I thank you for your trust. Inspect the battlefield and provide what aid you can to the troops. Speak with me when you feel that they are ready for battle. Mazkin! Form up! For the sake of your sorry male hide, to battle. move! Move! Are you prepared for Provide what aid you can. Okay. Whoa, whoa. What happened to more magic. Why are you guys attacking my guy? Idiots. Fight the dude. Huh, somebody knocked his soul out of my hand. Man. That's hilarious. Hey, hey, stop attacking my guy. Knights are sure to attack again. Yeah. They have been hassled. It seems that the knights. Do anything? Uh, we will. The knights. Vengeance will be ours. Hey, Vicky, what's going on? Why is the sand alert not working either? I don't know what is going on with my uh, channel point sand alerts. For some reason, they're not working right now. But how you doing, bud? Oh, he did. Those blue, blue eyes are now dead. All right. Well, apparently there's nothing I can help them with right now. So. Were you able to provide the maskin with aid? We have little in the way of supply. If you've done all. Th no. They want me to heal them. Do I even have a healing spell that does uh, distance? I've got absorb health, uh, consume health. Fortify health on self, fortify speed, self, self, restore intelligence on self. Yeah, I got nothing to help you guys. I'm not a healer. Were you able to, if you, very well. Get out here ahead of them so we can actually. Might as well use any potions I have in Magicka right now. Do I not have any potions in Magicka? Apparently not. Come on, guys, I already destroyed two of them. We have one. Attacking my guy. Three, four, back to your ranks, moron. Well, I guess I can just not Oh, I don't have any arrows equipped. And that would be why.
Oh, hit them both at the same time. Hey, you actually hit me. Working while I'm playing games. Cool, Vicky, I appreciate you. Keep going, bud. Oh, shit. Well, oh, whoops. Hey, whoopsie daisy. Victory is. We must discuss our next move. The spire. Yeah, yeah. I am not certain. The ruins of Zedifin run under Passwall. One of my scouts reported that the ruins. I did, and she. Yeah, if yeah, we attempt to assault. Additionally, our forces are dangerously. Your insight is impressive. Well, once inside, search for the. Good luck, your grace. Alright, let's do Walk it. With our Lord. To the spire! I guess we're going under the spire, but. Jumping on water. I guess I'll go the right way. What's up guys? I'm gonna walk right into your base, idiots. Yeah, I'm talking, trying to talk to you. You got nothing. Might as well heal one. Fucking around. Hello. Hello. Jump over that wall. Okay. See, so it's power and destroy it. There's grumites that are now dead. Oh, got anything good in these treasure chests? Potion of healing. Some more madness or. Literally the same thing. Yep. Alright. Well, we're going the right way. Oh, oh sir. I don't care about your dwarven helmet. Guys, all right. Got the priest. Their outfits remind me of the uh, <laughs> the priests of uh, what the fuck are they called? The ones from Skyrim, the DLC with Skyrim. Oh, hello. Okay, Albus 7 power amplified through the spire that leads to the center. We must find a way to shut down the Albus. Oh, we're gonna shut it down. Hello. It's... it's you. When they attacked, I ran from Passwall. Fellas and I slipped down here. Fellas ran off with them and left me to die. Me? I didn't say they took him. He went with them. I Every time I look for a way out. You seem to have no trouble, though. Look at you. Barely a... Maybe you're just a coward. Oh, sorry. I wasn't aware that being a courageous hero was a requirement around here. Look, you may be a scamp's ass... But I'm offering you the chance to be the hero of Passwall. 
escort me out of here, protect me, get me home, and those people will praise you more than you can imagine. I don't think so. You stay here. Sure, come with me. I'll do what I can to help. Okay, now... Can we get out? Stay here. Stay here? What's... I like that he's got his extra clothes and stuff like that. Got anything in that bag? You got a potion of healing. I'll take it. Okay. Wait here while I do everything. Okay. Pablo did not respond. I need to kill. Is there a priest around here I need to kill? Play some hearts. Luckily, I've got like 30 hearts on me right now, so it's not a big deal. I don't even have to bother killing them. Overlord of the Albus, they're coming around me. Must escape me from the trap. Now we go. Can we get? Let's just hurry this up. Come on, Sean. You're not invisible, so you gotta hurry. Run into them. No. Come on. Run, children. Button. Back, it's open. Oh, athletics first. the fridge. I'm going to stay here. Cool. Have fun. Running, keep running. What, what, what's going on? What, what, what's going on? Keep running now. They gotta get two more. I remember who you are. No, I 
don't know who you are, but uh, you're dead now. sword or pick up the other guy's sword hey all right let's go talk to her and see how it went <coughs> hey. your grace you're you're alive truly you are the greatest warrior ever to hold the seat of dementia it's true I was certain that no one could survive the spire's collapse, but here you are. I fear that our work is not yet done. You should return to the palace and speak with Sheogora. Okay. Through the tunnel. Secret tunnel. I thought I was actually gonna get hurt. I never went through this door the first time. They went through the dementia door. Okay, now let's go back and talk to Shay Gorth. That nice reflection of the sun. Oh yeah. Hello. Mad God. Walk with our Lord. Yes. The obelisks operate. They can eat. In the fringe, you can see for yourself the devastation that accompanies the grave. Yeah. The appearance of the Knights of Order. Where do they come from? Unlike typical invaders, the Knights do not arrive by conventional means. These crystalline obelisks have existed throughout the... M News of your success in the fringe precedes you. To further cement the victory, I have an important task for you to perform. You will seek the assistance of Relmina Veronum in Zalsel to rebuild the Gatekeeper. You remember? The creature you killed to get in here. With the gatekeeper restored and Zedillion in operation, we won't have to worry about anything getting in. Things already here are another matter. You'll need to speak with Relmina Veronum. With that done, the fringe should be secure. For all right. It's all moving faster than I'd expect. Get that gatekeeper in place. He's almost here. I can feel it. You won't like him as much as me. He doesn't even carry a cane. More the giant bone cleaving sword type of prince. If he's on his way, I'm on my way out. I already feel not quite myself. Not quite someone else, but not quite myself. It's essential. Simply essential. If only it were essentially simple, but it's not! I want him there guarding those gates. If any of Jigalag's forces show up, he should be ready for them. It wouldn't do to just let them in if more show up. Go talk to Relmina in Zasel. A powerful sorceress. Maybe a genius? <laughs> and a complete lunatic. All in all, my kind of person. Yeah. I brought her to my realm so she could continue to study her sixth element. Honestly, I didn't know there were five already. She's a bit obsessed with it. And with me! Makes dealing with her difficult. You shouldn't have any problems, though. No one likes you that much. All right. Send Relmina, my love. <laughs> That'll get her going. Do she is a powerful sorceress. 
She was expelled from the Mages Guild for this belief. Our Lord took interest and brought... You will find... As your grace know... As you wish. My work is never done. Well, boo. on the same side, but we can never be too safe. Whoa. Ow! Whoa. Heal up a bit. Traps and minions in here. Flesh Atronach. Hello, sir. Can you come into the light? I want to look at you. Oh, yeah. Ooh, just trust. Got some gold. Skin hound. Test subject. Failed experiment. Failed experiment. Standing up. While it is always best to believe in oneself. Hey, party, how you doing, help bud? From others can be a great blessing. How was your uh how was the rest of your stream? Join that Stardew life. Party. Dalish, can you shout him out? Ha! Ha! What's going on, guys? How's everybody doing? Thank you, Dalish. Sup, dude? There's all these guys down here. Fail experiment, some flesh, take some potions. <laughs> uh, culprit emotes, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Alright. We're just walking through here. We gotta rebuild the guardian or the gatekeeper. Um, I'm 
basically permanently invisible, so I don't have to worry about being attacked. So I'm just strolling on through. How's everybody doing today? It is Wednesday. We're halfway through the week. Well, sounds like someone's being tortured. Cool, cool, cool. If you die, <laughs> Does this hurt more or less than last time? Experimenting the pain there. Prime voice acting, that's right. You! I remember you! You're the adventurer who slew my gatekeeper, are you not? Yeah, but I'm gonna help you build a new one. Yeah, I slew him. I needed to get in. The ends justify the means, do they? You'll pay for that one day. Now, Will by I? all means, come right in. Walk in here as if you own the place. By what authority do you destroy? Anybody have any fun weekend plans coming up? By the authority of your lord, Shagorth. I see. Shagorth. Do I have a mod for the faces? Yeah, I've got a mod for the models. Um, and then a mod for he some of the uh, like textures on the outside, like plants and stuff like that also. Well then. I trust my servants didn't give you too hard a time getting in here. Makes it a little bit cleaner <laughs> since the game is, <laughs> you know, a bit older. Although sometimes they have weird stuff, like there's a, a bug where they have two faces. That's not specific to the mod, that just happens sometimes. A new gatekeeper is required. Nothing crazy this weekend, I might try to stream, which I've never done on the weekends yet. Right on, dude. Yeah, I, I don't stream on the weekends a ton, but it, it is nice to stream every now and then the weekends. Demands a new gatekeeper! Oh, does he now? Fine. If it be my lord's will, then it is also my own. But I'm too distraught over the death of my child. You gonna keep playing Stardew for a while, party? Own. This you must do. Just playing some tabletop with my friends. I think might stream this weekend to too. Nice. What well, tabletop home. games are you gonna play? There you will gather I'm always down for tabletop games. For I love ceremony. tabletop games. Go fetch me blood liqueur, osseous marrow, nice, dermis nice. membrane, and essence of breath. And take mm, this so key. Back, just, just, it will allow yeah. you into the gardens and give you direct access to nice, the sanctum. Nice, nice. Warhammer 40k. I've never played the tabletop for Warhammer. I've played, uh... You will travel to the gardens like of the, flesh uh, and bone and collect for me uh, these things. Warhammer 2 or whatever on the PC. Blood um... Are you not the exalted duke, slayer yeah, that's, of the that's great cool. gatekeeper, that's champion Stardew. of our mighty lord Sheagorath? Uh, not Dawn of War. I'm sure it's like you'll Warhammer be able to find these things. If um, not, perhaps Sheagorath's faith in you is misplaced. What the fuck is the subtitle? Go now. Ah, no, it's like a PC game. Patience. No, not Vermintide, though I do like Vermintide also. Um, I'm... but it's like the uh, almost like a RTS version of War uh, Warhammer. Many years I lay, but the fruits born of that. Total labor, war. Uh, that might be it. Or no, wait. Here, let me just pull my Steam real quick on you my phone and see and the what it's actually called. To bring my new child into this world, the Valley Wog will return to the water to heal. Oh yeah, I guess it is Total War. War Warhammer too. Oh, you mean my research subjects? Don't trouble yourself. But yeah, with been their playing heads. that, and the novel's been playing some Vermintide lately. But I've never played like actual tabletop uh, 40k. Besides, they are furthering important research into the nature of pain and suffering, of life and death. Don't be concerned. I always return the worthy ones to Man, life. Is way too hot. I'm sweating. Besides, Lord Sheagorath has sanctioned my studies and my methods. Any loyal servant of the Mad God would respect his decision in this matter. Did you guys give up Minecraft? I'm glad you are reasonable and open-minded. Away with you, dog, and fetch me those components. I mean, I could... How does this make uh! Let's see. Hang on now, made the fight harder for life. All right. 
So now we gotta head out, get the pieces of the gravekeeper, or Jack, whatever the fuck he's called, the uh, the guard. So many doors in this place. What about Minecraft? Oh, I was just asking if you guys had given up on Minecraft, or if you guys were still playing it, just not streaming it. Seven for everything. Nice. I like having dedicated servers. I might have a dedicated server for Ark for like, uh, I don't know, six, four or six months, something like that. Um, it's a lot of fun. I've put so much time into Ark. I love Ark. If you guys ever want to play Ark, just let me know. My old group kind of fell off of playing Ark. They all, we all switched to different games. Like half of us went from Ark to playing uh, Valheim, and then we stopped playing that game. <sighs> I haven't streamed again, but I've been on. Right on. But yeah, and then I went back and played Ark for a while, but it's just more fun with people. It's not as fun by yourself. Never tried Ark. It's a lot of fun. Ow! It's just like, it's just so ah! open. I really enjoy it. You can just build just kind of whatever. You can tame dinos. You can go run dungeons. You can, you can work on like bosses and stuff. Hey, Tito. How you doing, bud? Came in with that party raid. Um. But yeah, I just I really like art because you can do whatever. You can like just do farming if you wanted to, or breeding and all that kind of stuff. So how we doing? We're doing good, man. How are you doing? Oh god, why is everything falling apart in this place? Oh, crunch right on that fresh flesh at your knock. Yeah, we just uh, going around working on find nothing of use. Open. Oh, Playing some Oblivion. How about you, man? How you been? Hello, sir. Uh, oh man, I gotta go around. Watch your mimics want to play Elder Scrolls like right now. I mean, they're always good games. Love me some Oblivion. I tried to get back into Morrowind. It's just, it was a bit outdated for me. Like I got, uh, I put like 126 mods or something like that on it, and to like update the graphics and everything else. Um, but I don't know, I just wasn't feeling it. Somebody just like outdated things, like the fact that like you, you don't regain magicka after you use it unless you're like resting and stuff, um, stuff like that. And so I just I gave up, uninstalled it, and then. Just focused on Oblivion again. Mechanics are dated, but I have such a soft spot for it. Yeah, that's fair. I think a lot of us do. That. For a lot of us, I think it was probably our first uh, Elder Scrolls game. Ha! I know for me it was, but I didn't play a ton of it. Um, one of the kids I grew up with had a uh, Xbox, but he kind of hoarded it, so I only got to play a little bit of it. Not a too tiny of it, but I never got to like finish the game or anything. Tried Oblivion a very long time ago before I stood on RPGs, but I like Skyrim. Where does Oblivion take place in the universe? So Oblivion is before Skyrim, uh, as far as like chronologically, um, and yeah, and uh, as far as geographical. So if you guys can see, this is the map of Cyrodiil, which is where Oblivion is set. You can see Skyrim is just north. Um, so it's just north of there. You can see Morrowind to the east. This is the map of Cyrodiil, which again is Oblivion. This is the map of Shivering Isles, which is the DLC we're doing right now. And then that's the map of Vardenfell, which is Morrowind. We can't see it. Oh, boo. Here. So Skyrim, Morrowind, Black Marsh, elsewhere, Valenwood, Hammerfell, and then Cyrodiil. If you can see that. Alright, but, uh, 
But yeah, and that's set like before Skyrim, before all that. I think it's as far as like quest wise and stuff like that. And I always uh, tell people this whenever I'm we get on this conversation. But I think all of the quests are just better in Oblivion. Like they're just far more interesting. Um, they they're uh, just written more interesting. Like Skyrim has a lot of it has some good quests. Don't get me wrong, but. Like, even, like, for example, the main story... Oh, Dark Brotherhood, for sure. Dark Brotherhood quests in Oblivion are some... Probably my favorite quest line in any of the Elder Scrolls games. Um, but, like, even looking at the main quests, like, the whole thing with, like, the Civil War and the Dragon, it's not that interesting. At least to me. Um, but, like, when you look at uh, this one with, like, all of the... Uh, to hick um with all of the like oblivion gates and dealing with everyone's day gun and everything like that like it's just it's a lot of fun and more interesting and i really like a lot of the uh i really like a lot of the um the daedra quests they're a lot more fun in this game i think Oh, thanks for the shout out there, Dalish. I'm just following this weird breath. Did your stuff is somewhere interesting than dragons? Yeah, for sure. And it's like, in this game, like, it's an actual, like, like, the final boss isn't just, like, you one-on-one -on -one something like that. It's like, um, you know, there's, like, actually, like, more stuff going on. I don't want to spoil anything, um, since Bohish hasn't played, but, you know, there's just more going on and stuff like that than just like a straight fight whereas in like Skyrim it's just like you fight the dragon end of story so yeah I think they're quite a bit more interesting and the thieves guild I think is really um I think the thieves guild is really interesting also for the uh there we go uh the thieves guild is really interesting in Oblivion whereas again in Skyrim it's not that everyone's taking the yellow in the Alduin yeah for sure Oblivion items seem, ideas seem cooler, yeah. What are the thoughts in Starfield? So I'm more of a fantasy guy than a sci-fi guy, so I, I really don't know how I'm going to feel about that, but I don't know. I mean, I might give it a shot or whatever. I really hope that with Elder Scrolls VI, they go um, back more to the roots of like an actual RPG. Like, Skyrim was just so watered down. Um... So I'm, I'm really hoping that they'll more go back to it. Um, but you never know. Um, but yeah, I mean, I don't know about Starfield. I'm, like I said, I'm not a big sci-fi guy. I like some sci-fi stuff, like Ma Mass Effect. Great series. I've played a ton of that. Um, but in general, I, I enjoy fantasy quite a bit more. Door is opened elsewhere. Well, where is it opened? Here we go. All the blood. Alright, now we gotta return to her. Uh, but yeah, Bohij, if you haven't, um, if you, if you have Oblivion, or if you have like Xbox Game Pass, Oblivion's free on there. Um, I highly recommend playing it. Fantastic game. There are a few kind of quirks with some of the like fighting mechanics and stuff like that. Um, do you see Guard of War? Oh man, I did not even notice the. Uh... I don't even know where that message was. I don't even see that message in my list. Oh, there it is. The Guard of War has been added to Unite. That's cool. I didn't even know that. Um, I haven't played a ton of Unite. But it's alright so far. Um, do have Game Pass, I'll give it a shot. Yeah, man. I mean, I highly recommend it. It's, you know, it's not perfect. It's But some of the mechanics, especially fighting mechanics and stuff like that. I will say Skyrim, I liked how, like, they did the magic. As far as, like, you know, you could, uh, like, basically do wield magic and stuff like that. Um, but I will say this one's really nice because you actually get to create your own spells. And that opens up a lot of, a lot of, uh variability and everything like that, which is a lot of fun. Um, 
spend all my money on Garchomp. Yeah, I've played... I want to get Gengar, but I've been playing as uh, Machamp the, like, four games I played. I haven't played a ton of it. Normally, I like, uh... If I'm gonna play a MOBA, I'll play Heroes of the Storm. Spellcrafting is neat. Yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff you can do. It's, it's pretty cool. I will say another thing that I don't like about just the progression of uh, games in general, from Morrowind to Skyrim. Gotta add you in there. Oh, for sure, dude. Uh, if you want to post your Switch code, um, or your uh, Pokemon trainer code, whatever the heck, um, in the Discord, or message me, or whatever, I can add you on there next time I'm on there. Dude, I've been playing. Nice. But uh, one thing I'll say that I, I'm not a fan of is uh, Skuma. Because if you guys played Morrowind, uh, Skuma was like a legit drug and had crazy effects and like some very negative effects, but some really cool ones with like how fast it made you and stuff. If you drank enough Skuma, you could like fly across the map and shit. Um, resembling the Avengers, that's right. Oh, and Annette. No way! I'm never talking um, to you ever again. But uh, she found out what I told it's, you. It's, yeah, nerfed every game and it bums you out. Yeah, for you sure. Because no it went from, like, super drug that she... very much had its, like, good effects and bad she... effects. And then Oblivion, it was kind of Just like, eh, like it gives Go you some away. buffs and some negatives. And then by freaking, um, by freaking Skyrim, it's like, basically, if I remember correctly, Skyrim is just, uh, all it does is gives you stamina. The younger brother of plays an addict. That's awesome. Oh, there you are. I didn't even see you. You have returned with all the components? Excellent. All that remains is to choose the body parts. Let's do it. Fearing one day someone might manage to kill my child, I have been preparing a new body. I've created versions of each appendage with various enhancements. There he goes. You, you can help me pick the body parts one here. Of each. I am attached to them all. Select one pair of legs. All right, so don't take all day making your choices. Shut up. All right, let's see here. So we got the arm of fire shielding, shock shielding, or frost shielding. So do we want this new gatekeeper to be have resistance to frost, shock, or fire? What do you guys think? I would make a poll, but I can't alt-tab out of this, otherwise the game will crash. So, that's one thing, Bohij, when you do go to play. Just an FYI, uh, Elder Scrolls games don't like to be alt-tabbed out of on PC. So if you do that, it'll crash. Say fire. Alright, party says fire. Anybody else? I'm going once. We got fire, shock, and frost. I'm going twice. Alright. Grab the shielding. Come in Okay, just swaps it out. Go for fire. All right. So now we got legs of fortitude or legs of nimbleness. Do we want him to be, you know, a little bit healthier and stronger here, or do we want him to be fast and quick? I got him slowly sinking between the two things. Buff boy, go fortitude. All right. All right, so now for weapons, we have the Arm of Chopping, the Arm of Bashing, or the Arm of Slashing. What do we think? So we bash, slash, or chop. Now oh, I'm out of water. Womp womp. Team Bash, all right. Bash, oh man, you guys are of a like mind. All right. Do we want Breasts of Magic or Breasts of Life? Do we want him to be more healthy or have... I'm assuming this is just like a resistance to magic. I don't think he actually gets magic, but I could be wrong. Life, I suppose. All right, all right, all right. Now we got a heart, heart of spell turning, or heart of wound sharing. 
So wound sharing is like, you know, you attack it, you take damage too. Spell turning is the same thing, but for spells, spells reflect by a certain percentage back at him. So we want to reflect spells or share wounds. I want to reflect spells. All right, all right. And then all that's left is the head. Angry mind or helm of power. Do we want him to be angry or more powerful? There was a time when I knew this, but oh, you guys voted for different ones this time. Tito, if you're still there, do we want to go angry or helm of power? Somebody's got to be the cider. Power does look cooler, though. Let's see. Anybody? Anybody else? Any third person? Angry. Helm of power. Alright, looks like it's just you two. Um, no for power. Alright. Power it is. Let's go make a new gatekeeper. You've made your selection. Now we travel to the statue of our lord in the fringe. Okie dokie. Just like the word angry. That's fair, that's fair. And out the door. And to the fringe. After we finish this quest, we'll probably call it a night. Not gonna lie, I keep forgetting my guy's a vampire. How'd you get ahead of me? Shall we start the ceremony? Let's do it. First, place the gatekeeper's body into the cistern of substantiation. The cistern of substantiation. All the pieces. At the beginning of the worlds were five. Fire, water, earth, air, and light. That sweet, sweet Darkness sky. turned into day. The void took form. Hidden away by virtue of its own self-awareness was the sixth, containing within it the five which birthed it. Flesh! Meet with the desire to consume like fire. Place the dermis membrane into the system. Blood, liquid nutrient. That ocean which casts pearls of life upon the shores of existence. Place the blood liquor into the cistern of substantiation. and stone of the body giving shape and structure place the osseous marrow into the system breath child of air bestowing movement the stirring of spirit place the essence of breath into the cistern of substantiation I did it and last, the light of flesh, the illumination of soul, perception, thought, like her, uh, fancy memory, dress. imagination. I summon thee, walker in flesh, flesh of true flesh, from those waters of oblivion which sire thy kind. Come to this altar, join with this body quintessence of flesh joined with the essence of flesh absolute immortal immortal bound to contingent stand clear of the cistern over here by me i'm here by you honored daedra 
fear not thy abasement. Thou shalt be the holy in this temple. I bind thee, astronaut, to this body. Henceforth, gatekeeper of the shivering isles. Hey, bud. My child, it is time to fulfill your destiny. Stand guard. Right, guys, we did good. This bashing arm, this helm of power, those sweet, sweet, formidable legs. I'm gonna jump just to get ahead. Get him! What power did I get? I clicked it so many times, I don't even know which one I ended up with. Did I not click on it? No, I don't want your stupid. Get him! Hey, it's Fellas! Jackass was on our party earlier and went that way. I want the fire shielding. There's a fortitude. Alright, I'll take that. Get up! Beat the shit out of these guys. I'll help you. There you go. You're welcome. Alright. Now let's go turn the quest. Go talk to Shea Goreth here. Sky. For a game this old, that's still real pretty. A new gatekeeper! Excellent! We might be onto something with you after all. That should keep out the strike. The sea, you've learned how to summon flesh astronauts. Relmina must like you, little Duke. But probably not in that way. Lord Sheogorath, you just pushed me out of the way, I apologize for the intrusion, but you must help us. Order has attacked Brelok and routed us. Well, well. What a turn of events this is. It's new, and I like new, even if it's bad. And this is bad, isn't it? I know. This is a particularly exciting turn of events, is it not? A perfect job for you, my newest and only noble in the realm. If order has entered my army stronghold, things have taken a disturbing turn. It means order has tried subterfuge. Not its strong suit. Ha ha ha! Amazing! Perhaps things aren't going as poorly as I'd imagined. You'll want to get all the details from the messenger. Unless you already have. You haven't, have you? Well, aren't you precious? Do you really not know? Spoiler. Haven't you noodled it all through yet? Because he is me! I'm him! We're a bit of each other, really. I, I won't be here when he arrives, because I'll be him. Got to dip out. Have a good night. Happens every yeah, time. Yeah, you have the a good night, too. Starts, I'll be able to go. I will talk to you later. And I become Jigalag and wipe out my whole realm. Hey, Tito, you have a good night, too, man. Yeah, it's late for you, bud. Get some rest. I will talk to you later, and I hope you have a good night. Plot twist. Soon. Too soon! I can already feel the change beginning. I feel like I'm not quite here. I'm not over there yet, but I'm not quite here! And I've been having moments of clarity that are quite unlike me. Like now. 
Stop it? Oh no, can't do it. Believe me, I've tried. It never ends well. But you're still going to stop the Grey March. Stop Jigalag. Me? From destroying my realm! Now? Nothing has changed. You deal with this messenger. Make sure my army is secure. You'll need them. Cats out of the bag on that one, isn't it? Who puts cats in bags anyway? Cats hate bags. Soon, I'll turn into Jigalag. There's no stopping it. That doesn't excuse you from your duties, though. Get to it! Your job is still to stop it. No stopping now. All right. Ah! Come visit again! Or out! Look out your eyes! <laughs> I'm gonna save here and call it a night. Alrighty. Cool. Well, I appreciate everyone popping in here. Uh, it was a fun stream. Um, I am probably not gonna end up streaming on Friday. Um, just because I have to. I'm only streaming on Friday if I get my homework done by Friday on the week, and this is the first week of my new term, and I underestimated having two classes this term how much homework I would have, so I'm not done yet. So I probably won't be streaming Friday, but there's the potential. If not, I will be back Monday um, for some more Oblivion, uh, but I hope everyone has a good night. Um, excuse me. Um... So we are just going to go raid uh, Skyfire Gaming. They're playing New World right now, which is the new MMO of Amazon's that's uh, in beta right now. Um, so we're just going to pop over there and say hey. But I hope everyone has a good night, and I will talk to you guys later.